Education is important for everyone. Some students, though, require some extra help through their educational journey. For those students, school districts have special education departments. UTPA is a special education program trains the leaders of those departments. If you're interested in learning more about a master's in special education, join us today in this episode of Grad School Now. As we talk to program director, Dr. John Laudermilk, and we hear the story of a successful student who has been through the program. Dr. Laudermilk, uh, can you please tell us how did you get involved with the uh, special education pro program and how did it start for you? Okay, well, for me, um, I received my doctorate at the University of North Texas, and then I did a postdoc at the University of Kentucky. And postdoc just means I wanted to spend more time in school because I wasn't sure exactly what I wanted to do. And my wife, my wife and I both are from Texas, and she wanted to come back to uh, Texas. So I started looking in the Chronicle of Higher Ed for a position in special education in higher ed. And I found this one. I put in my application, flew down here. Uh, this is actually the only place I interviewed at and fell in love with the Valley and Pan Am. The program offers many exciting opportunities, such as the ability to work in traditional school or hospital settings, plus a few opportunities unique to UTPA. Can you tell us one unique feature of the special education program? Well, the graduate special education program is about to be 100% online and it's going to only be 30 hours long. And we're going to have a real strong emphasis in multicultural special education, which is something you do not see in very many programs around the country. But it's a program that you would be able to finish in about 18 months. And once you finish that, if you want to become an educational diagnostician, you just have to come back, take a few more courses, and you're certified as an ed diag also. The online program uh, starts officially in the spring of 2014. And we're taking applications as, you, as we speak. Students can find the application online at utpa.edu slash gradapply. How can students apply for, for the program? Well, what they need to do is go on to our website through uh, College of Education, Educational Psychology, and then it's the Graduate Special Education, and on the front page there's a link that will take you to a form to fill out. You fill that form out, someone from our partner uh, program, Academic Partnerships, will call you up, an academic coach, and they will take you through the entire process. It's a very simple process. Dr. Laudermilk knows the program's rigorous, but states that the department has worked hard to fit coursework into a busy student's schedule. Is there anything else you would like to add? Uh, just that uh, our program is 30 hours. It's totally online. You would never have to come up to campus unless you wanted to. And I think we have a pretty strong program. And one of the nice things about special education is even five years ago, there was something like a shortage of 80,000 special ed teachers across the country. It is a job you can definitely uh, have a very rewarding and fulfilling career in. Many measure the strength of a graduate program through the success of students who have graduated from that program. Cristina Rangel is one of many students who graduated from UTPA's special education program and is now a successful special education teacher in her school district. I'd like to consider myself a product of the program. Um, I, I won't be modest to say that I think I'm actually one of probably the best special education teachers in my district. While Rangel takes pride in her accomplishments as a special education teacher, she admits that obtaining a master's degree was not entirely her idea. Getting a master's uh, initially was never my idea, if that makes sense. Nothing worth doing is ever easy, and Rangel had to work hard to get into the program. Once accepted, she found support from those around her. I think that one of the things that makes this program really great are the people that are in the program. Um, I know that I had a lot of guidance and a lot of mentoring while I was in the program. I know that I had uh, professors who had a lot of faith in me as a person and I think that faith that I didn't even have in myself. Through the faith of her professors, Rangel developed faith in her own abilities. 
as her confidence grew, so did a surprising understanding. I come from the same background, the same experiences that a lot of the students come from. Today, details of Van Hel's past help her connect with current students. I come from uh, the disadvantaged home, the social economic disadvantaged home. Um, I was that at-risk student. I was at one point considered migrant. Support, according to Van Hel, was a key to her own success in both grad school and after in her own classroom. These people saw things in me that I didn't see in myself, and that's what I try to do with my students. You know, I try to see things in them that they don't see themselves. Today, this UTPA graduate takes lessons she learned on campus to her own classroom. I've said it for the last eight years that I've had my master's, and I will continue to say it. You know, um, Dr. Laudermilk, Dr. Fielding played a really big role in who I am today. Currently, Rangel works as a special education teacher, but her leadership does not stop there. Rangel has returned to UTPA to instruct a new generation of special education teachers. For more information on the graduate programs, visit utpa.edu gradschool. I'm your host, Miriam Gomez, and this is Grad School Now.